Still no word from Major Jorgen or Kalia. Everything within a kilometer of the spire has been locked down. No signal gets in or out of that zone. I warned you that Gemini frequency mission was dangerous. If they're alive, it won't be for much longer. The gravestone could take the enemy by surprise. Buy me enough time to get our people out of the spire. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We can't throw the gravestone into the fire unless we know they're alive to rescue. Too much remains unknown, and the enemy has had time to prepare its defense. We cannot risk any rescue operation. I'll alert you the moment I hear anything, but until then, we're just wasting time here. We could all use a break to regroup. That includes you, Theron. I'm too tired to argue. Oh, almost forgot. Hilo Viz asked to see you, Commander. Wouldn't say why, but it sounded important. On your mind. We're doing our best to keep the supply lines running, but most of the people I deal with aren't exactly philanthropists. We can't keep running this thing on goodwill and borrowed credits. You're saying we need a steady income. Or a really big slush fund. But look, I didn't just come here with complaints. I know a guy with a habit of showing up when someone's in need. He's reached out with an offer we can't really refuse, much as I might want to. You should meet him. Make the arrangements. I'll at least hear what he's offering. Well, he's already here, and it's probably best not to leave him to his own devices. Come on. This has been an interesting diversion, but I think it's time to wrap things up. I call. Come on, Lana. Now? I fold. So soon? Must be quite a hand. Let's see it. But how? I mean, you discarded every chance you got and never locked a card the whole round. The odds are astronomical. You cheated. Yeah, even if I did, you sure the old boss of Sith intelligence wants to admit some shifty alien got the better of her? Wasted no time turning the card table into a graveyard. It's my preferred method of execution. Commander, the most untrustworthy scoundrel I know. Untrustworthy scoundrel, the Commander. She never was big on formalities. Galt Renault, at your service. for me. The Eternal Empire spent the last five years pillaging every world in the known galaxy. Now, how'd you like to turn all that plundering into a profit for you and yours? I'm listening. I happen to know where they're keeping all that ill-gotten gain. Better yet, I've got a surefire plan to steal it right out from under their noses. I just need the help of a few talented, tough customers to see it through. And my alliance is the perfect place for recruitment. I've already picked out the ones we'll need. Ever heard of the Gilded Star? I'll stop you there. You haven't. It's one of the Eternal Empire's most tightly guarded secrets. A floating treasury circling the depths of a massive gas giant. The ship and the buried treasure all wrapped up into one neat little package. Well, maybe not little. By my estimation, it's the greatest sum of wealth gathered in one place since the Hut Empire was a thing. So, you in? I'm in. When you're ready to get this show on the road, we'll be heading to Vanden to lay some groundwork. Looking forward to this, partner. 